Hello everyone, and welcome back to Wolf Quest 2.7.2, where Little Bear is apparently about to be attacked by a coyote. Okay, that's not happening. That's not happening. All right, well, that definitely has our day starting off pretty quickly, and a little bit too quickly for Kuma, who was actually injured yesterday when he was defending the pups from being eaten by a cougar. Poor Willow is like tripping over this bush. She doesn't know which direction to go. Spirit is going to keep over, like watching the puppies at the den, though Willow so let's just continue to run down oh man kuma is such a tough wolf i just imagine he kind of like has all of these wounds let's just grab this this elk because it's close he's got all these wounds from that face-to-face -face fight with the cougar and he just had to like fend off a coyote from attacking his wolf pups <laughs> and he just like runs down the mountain probably with like all of these open gashes because he knows he needs to get the energy to be able to defend his pups again I think this is a moment where Willow is really, really grateful for just how strong her mate is. Alright, let's get back up because we need to feed the pups. Kuma knew that they are hungry and that they need care, so he wasn't going to waste any time. And, oh, all right. Well, that was a quick way to start the day. We are here with Kuma and Willow's third litter of wolf pups. Oh dear, there's a coyote. Already? What is with this? No, this is not, this is not acceptable, coyote. Get out of here. We haven't even run into a bear yet. Oh my gosh. We haven't even run into a bear to be able to like earn any ancestor blessings and we have also lost an ancestor blessing because Pebble was attacked and killed by a coyote yesterday as well. A bear! Okay! Look! I know I was just saying, oh we haven't even run into a bear and like kind of in a sideways manner hoping for a bear, but I didn't, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it like this. <laughs> Alright, how about no bear? Alright, get out of here. All right, yes! We chased the grizzly away, which means we only need to chase away two more grizzlies before we can get an ancestor blessing, but oh my gosh. All right, oh, and now the puppies are about to starve to death. Well, yeah, welcome back, everybody. Just a normal, absolutely frantic day of uh, running around taking care of our wolf pups here on our mountain. And actually, I'm thinking, you guys, if Kuma is able to finish the challenge that he faces this litter, then we should have the rights to rename this mountain. And what do you think we should rename it? So for those of you guys who don't know, yesterday it was revealed that the challenge that Kuma has to take on, on top of just keeping the pups alive and on top of defending his territory. All right, let's give it a good howl so Spirit will watch over the wolf pups. There we go. But on top of all of those things, the challenge that Kuma has to face this time is chasing away an invading pack of wolves. A very aggressive, invasive pack of wolves. Okay, which one of our little ones is about to try to be eaten? Dawn. No. Dawn is also our reborn wolf spirit, but I'll talk about that. Ah, oh, Kuma! Come on, Kuma! There goes another bear. All right, let's go. Let's go and heal up, and then we'll be back to try to defend the pups some more. At least we're almost up to another ancestor blessing. That's a positive, right? Oh my goodness. Oh, so first things first, there's so much going on every episode. I hope you guys are hanging in there, okay? Oh my gosh, and be sure to ask in the comments if you're confused about something because our amazing community and the amazing wikia that people have started to put together, it's linked in the video description as well, should hopefully make everything very clear for you guys. Oh my goodness. All right, let's go ahead and eat this elk. Whew. But every litter of wolf pups, we take on an extra challenge that we give our wolves to face because we're up to almost 300 episodes of Wolf Quest, my friends. And that means there's a coyote there that we need to chase away. Unfortunately, we can't leave a single coyote. Like, once it shows up, we can't leave it because it will follow us back and it will kill our wolf pups if we don't. Oh, and there's some... I wonder if we could chase an elk towards the den. That might be really useful. Come on, Willow. Let's give it a good run. I'm pretty sure we'd be able to do it. We'd be downwind over here. There's one elk. Do you see her spinning in place? Is she a weak one? There's a weak one. All right, come on, Willow. Let's chase this elk down, see if we can tackle her. Was that a fox? I think I just saw a fox out of the corner of my eye. Man, today is not letting up. But as you guys know, every litter of wolf pups, we take on an extra challenge. At almost 300 episodes of Wolf Quest, which is quite a lot, we have gotten pretty good at doing this. And under normal circumstances, we usually have no problems whatsoever in being able to normally take out an elk. What on earth, elk? This isn't cool. Kuma can't, uh, Kuma can't even land the first blow. What is this? All right, maybe if I can get a good run at her. Ah, dang it. All right, she kind of tripped right there. Can 
Is there some way? Willow, why is she so fast? Because Kuma is, well, he is kind of a slow wolf. Come on. Come on, Elk. Come on. Let's see if Willow can help us out. What on earth? You shouldn't be faster than us. I need that not to happen, please. What? Ah! I'm gonna have to give up on this hunt. Kuma. Kuma, when did that happen? All right, well, we'll have to kind of crouch. We're gonna have to give it a good lunge and just not let go, I guess. Okay, go. No, Kuma, you were supposed to run. <laughs> oh, but every litter, because we've gotten more or less, so I thought, good at Wolf Quest as we're chasing, frantically chasing elk rumps here. Come on, come on, land at least one blow, please. <laughs> just bite her, bite her, bite her. Oh, that's not, that's not boding well. Oh, I'm a little bit worried about that then. All right, well, let's go up and get a feed our wolf pups. They're getting extremely hungry. We'll howl to let Spirit know that we're on our way back with a little bit of food in our stomachs. There we go. That has to be so cool for the pups and Spirit to hear. But yeah, so the challenge this time is to fight off an invading aggressive wolf pack who really has a bone to pick, a pretty severe dangerous bone to pick with Kuma. And that means we need to allow three stranger wolf encounters to happen at the den. And we need to be able to defend the den. And that's the challenge that has to happen to win the challenge with an ancestor blessing. We need to successfully chase away all of those wolves without losing a wolf pup to just have the challenge come and then go, even if- oh, okay! Okay, how about no? I'm trying to feed my babies here! Willow, feed! Willow, where to go? Willow, where'd the coyote go? Okay, Willow, feed the babies. No, a coyote! No! Oh my gosh! <laughs> this is a very eventful litter! Oh my gosh! Get here, coyote! Feed the babies! They're starving to death! Willow, help! Willow, help! Little bear, you need some food! Pebble, flare, dawn! Oh my gosh! But there is an invading wolf pack coming who has a big bone to pick with Kuma for unknown reasons. I'm actually going to leave that in your guys' paws to be able to decide why they may have a bone to pick with Kuma. But I'm thinking if Kuma manages to chase them off, looks like Little Bear and Pebble are the only ones who are who are willing to focus. There is another coyote already. We've got to get rid of it. We've got to go get more food. I can't believe Kuma couldn't chase down that elk. That is not going to bode well for when we need to teach them their hunting skills. Not at all. All right, let's go ahead and give another howl. So the wolf pups know we're coming. This one's getting tricky. But if he does manage to chase all of those wolves away successfully, and I'm kind of letting the uh, I'm kind of letting the territory markers decline a little bit on purpose, because if I do that, then we may we may have stranger wolves coming, and we can start chasing them off as part of the challenge. But if he does manage to chase them off and uh, we don't run out of ancestor blessings and we're able to keep all four wolf pups alive as a result, I was thinking we should rename the mountain that we're on. It's currently just the Saddle Meadows Mountain, like the Saddle Meadows, well, it's kind of a mountain, we'll call it a mountain. But I was thinking if Kuma manages to chase away the invasive wolves, then I feel like after having successfully raised his pups on this mountain for so long and having defended it, we should rename the mountain. We should name it for the Starry Skies pack or we should name it for Kuma. So let me know what you guys think about that because I think, I think he's earned it. Kuma's really been an amazingly strong wolf. I don't know if he has the slyness that Nightlight had and Eclipse had, uh, that Moondancer had too, but he is a good Starry Skies kind of descendant. Well, I should say Stormy Skies descendant, and he is a Starry Skies heir too. So I think he's got a little bit of in, like the slyness that the Moon Pack has, just not quite as much as you might expect to kind of stumble on. Speaking of stumbling on, all right, doesn't look like. Now I would say that Clover definitely has the Moon Pack slyness in her blood. Yeah, it doesn't look like the elk are anywhere near here. Fooey. All right, well let's go feed the pups. Try to defend them. Try to keep them alive. This is proving to be. <laughs> A little bit more of a taxing challenge than I thought it would be just to keep them alive. Is that an elk? The elk are invading our den site! <laughs> Look at this! What is this nonsense? 
What is it with today? I don't even understand. Everything is just cattywampus. Oh, I feel like the ancestors are like just playing a joke. Is it gonna rain? If it rains, I know for a fact the ancestors are just playing a joke at this point. All right, well, I guess you can't really ask for more than the elk being weakened and on my mountainside and headed towards my den. So you really can't ask for better hunting than this. No, I don't want to hunt her. I want to hunt this one right in front of me. Go! Go, 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 go! Oh, for crying out loud! Okay, take that one then! Grab her and don't let go, Kuma! Grab her! Kuma! Willow, help! Willow, help push! Willow, Willow, help me push! Oh my gosh! No, she's too fast! How is she too fast? What are we gonna do? Willow, get her! Willow! Willow, that's right, go get her! No, Willow, don't slow down! I don't know what to do! Okay, we're gonna have to follow Willow. Let's regain our our help. I am not sure how we're gonna handle this. Guys, the elk have suddenly become too fast for us to hunt down. Okay, there. All right, we just have to work harder at hunting him apparently. Go, Willow, go! I'm gonna try to regain my stamina as quickly as possible, but it looks like we're gonna rely on you to slow her down. Oh my gosh, and the wolf pups are starving. They're very, very hungry wolf pups. I wonder if we're just running across like a bunch of stringy elk and so the food isn't very filling. Are, they, are you guys too skinny? You guys should be fatter. If you were fatter, my wolf pups wouldn't be so hungry. All right, let's, let's work our way up. Well, the elk are invading our den, but at least we managed to take one down with Willow's help. But now I'm worried that we're going to start losing wolf pups like flies if I don't manage to get up to the top of the mountain and feed our wolf pups now. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, and we still have to defend our wolf pups, so who knows what is going to be waiting for us when we get up there. Go faster, Kuma! Oh my gosh, he's out of stamina. He has, he's just, he's like a tank. He's not very fast. He's built, he's super strong, just built like a tank. Ah, <gasps> uh, a faster wolf would probably be a better heir, but, like, for next time. But we'll worry about that later. I can't believe we have to run. Get out of here! Alright, you guys better help kick at some coyotes if you're gonna bother to invade my den. Where the heck is my den? Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, that's a stranger wolf, all right. Okay. Okay, please, 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 please. Okay, there's one bite. How about, oh my gosh, I can't believe it. We've actually got the stranger wolf. We've actually got the stranger wolf. Oh my gosh. And quick footed. And we just chased it away. Okay, and is my puppy, or my puppy's about to starve to death. <gasps> I can't believe we've chased one out of three of them away already. Flare, holy days. Eat! Eat! Have some stringy elk! <laughs> Willow, help me! <laughs> Feed them, Willow! Little bear, come here and get some food! Oh my gosh! This has been... Oh, Dawn! Dawn, come here! Dawn, you go there! Oh my goodness! I... Oh my goodness! No! Oh my goodness! I can't remember the last time we've had so much trouble at the den site. Oh no, you don't. No, you don't. Not my babies. Oh! <sighs> Yeah, I really can't remember the last time we've had so much trouble keeping our pups alive. Thank goodness they're at least defended. Oh my goodness. Which one are you? Dawn, Dawn, Dawn. It's okay. It's okay. Come eat. I think Dawn gets really anxious for unknown reasons because she doesn't remember the fact that she's a reborn ancestor. And Dawn is one of the wolf pups who died a long time ago. She originally was actually one of, um, okay, Pebble. How about no? Is that- oh, it's a coyote. Pebble! Jeez, why are you so appetizing to- Pebble, no! Pebble! Oh gosh! The elk are still here! Help! <laughs> There's so much going on! <laughs> oh my goodness! Okay, there's that. I'm gonna give it a good howl. I'm growling, not howling. There we go. We're gonna give it a good howl so spirit knows what's going on. And then we're going to see if I can maybe get Willow's attention and we can do a little bit of hunting over here. Because what even is this about with the with the elk over here? I don't even know. Is there a weak one? I want a weak one. Alright, she took off. There she is. There's two weak ones. Which one's weaker? I would bet you money this one's weaker. Right there. Yes, she is. Okay, let's slow down. She's gonna. She's not going to know we're coming up over the edge of the hill here. And maybe we can get her. I can just get closer. Oh, now we're upwind. Dang it. She's just going to take off like like 
like that. All right. But maybe I can chase her across the mountain and pin her down. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, get her, get her, get her, get her, get her, get her. You can do it, Kuma, for crying out loud. She's right there. Jump for the rump. Jump for it. Oh, he's so slow. He's so slow. I'm just going to have to creep towards her. Hunting is going to be a big pain in the elk rump when it comes time. Oh, and the wind changed directions on us. Hunting is going to be a big pain in the elk rump when it comes time to try to hunt down these elk. Okay, dang it, she heard us. Okay, wait for it, wait for it. No, we're downwind again. There's no point, there's no point. I'm just, fine, we're gonna, we're gonna find food elsewhere unless I can get lucky and, come on, come on, come on, Willow, help me out here. Oh, there's a bear, okay. Bear's a little bit more relevant to my interest right now. How about we chase you away, sir? Wow, Kuma barely even paused on that. <laughs> barely even paused. <laughs> barely and paused. <laughs> oh my gosh, the, the bear is chasing the elk. <laughs> oh my gosh. And guys, oh my goodness. That was also another one of the bears. That was the 30th bear Kuma has chased away. So we have another ancestor blessing. Wow. All right. Well, things are keeping very, very quick paced and interesting here. I'm going to take Kuma down to get a little bit of fresh food. So hopefully he can get some elk into his blood system and feel a little bit better for that. Oh my gosh. And we're going to try to keep these pups alive long enough to chase away two more of the stranger wolves. And if we can do that, then we will have defeated the strange pack that is showing up and trying to challenge Kuma for mastery of this mountain. And if he wins, I do think we should rename Silo Meadows dedicated to one of our wolf packs or maybe to Kuma. So let me know what you guys think about that. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.